Welcome to the fifth video in this series, How to Use the Bitly Link Shortener. In this video, I'm going to show you how to create bundles of bitmarks. The first step, as always, is to go to bitly.com. I've got that up here in my URL address bar. And it brings up my bitly bitmarks page. We've all seen this before. I've demonstrated it in other videos. But this time, I want you to go from bitmarks here over to bundles and this will look like a completely blank page because you don't have any bundles yet. And like this definition says, a bundle is a collection of bookmarks. So if you have certain bitmarks that are similar in content or in what you use them for, then you could create a bundle of them and keep them organized that way. This helps you not have to look through your entire list of bitmarks once you're up to, oh, let's say, a couple hundred or even a couple thousand eventually it enables you to quickly find your bitmark without having to search through the whole list. So let's click on create a new bundle. And the title of this bundle will be YouTube videos. The description could be YouTube channels or videos I liked. And then you could choose whether to make it a private or public bundle and click make bundle. Alright, so now we have a empty bundle. Oh dear. Let's add some bitmarks to that bundle so that we can expand it and have it actually serve a purpose. So let's click on the add bitmark and all the bitmarks that I have come up below it. So I'd like to add these two, this YouTube channel one and this YouTube channel one. So we'll click on mine first, good, and add another bitmark, let's add this one. So now as you can see this new bundle that we've created called YouTube videos now contains two different bitmarks. One is to the Dr. Gary North site, which is a YouTube channel that I appreciate learning from. Second is my personal YouTube channel, the BA at 17 videos. Okay, so this over here is just some information about your individual bundle. If we refresh it, you'll see that it goes to two bitmarks because we've added two. It was updated just now, and those two bitmarks together have one view. All right, I'm the curator of this site. I could add another person because it is a public bundle. Reorder, hide them, delete the bundle, all kinds of stuff you can do. But the important part is just that you can organize them so that you can find your bitmarks later. Otherwise, if you can't find the bitmark, it really defeated the purpose of creating that short customized link. All right, that will do it for the bundles video. In the next video, I'm going to demonstrate how to use another tool called the add bitmark tool.